Walter, we've talked about it, but I, I wonder if you could summarize sort of the difference between the Fusion I.O. approach, um, very close to the, to the mm -hmm. CPU, versus uh, taking f SSD and mm -hmm. putting it into a, a disk controller-based subsystem. That's right. Um, the two general schools of thought. One is to have it pretend to be a disk drive and sit inside of the disk infrastructure, which seems like an easy target for very you know, quick deployment. That would be kind of like having flash chips uh, you know how you carry a USB thumb drive? Sure. Well, see, Flash already displaced one form of magnetic media, the floppy drive. Notice it didn't replace the floppy drive by looking like a floppy disk and going in all those floppy disk readers. There was actually a company that did that, and they didn't last very long because <laughs> the USB port was just way too convenient to get more uh, capabilities. Um, well, we, we thought the same thing. Flash is a memory device and should be integrated into systems as a memory device to be able to, to truly exploit the additional capabilities, right? Because the last thing you want to do with a more, it's more expensive than disk drives, right? So you don't want to handicap its potential benefit. So we said, we should be focusing on how to optimize to extract the most benefit from the flash, not optimize to have it pretend to be like the old school stuff. Right. Can you talk